All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn CSS Flexbox by building a photo gallery. Step seven. So in order to better visualize how our elements are sized, adding a border can be helpful. So we're gonna give our gallery element, so it's gonna be the gallery uh, class, that's what that dot means, element a width of 50% and a border set to 5px solid red. And then we're gonna give our image elements a width of 100%, padding set to 5px and a border set to 5px solid blue. All right. So we're gonna start off, oh, first things first, notice how this is blank now. That's because we're on the styles.css and no longer on the HTML, right? So this is the this is the other page we're doing. So we're going to say here first dot gallery to target the uh, gallery class. And inside here, we're gonna do width is now 50, 50%. And we've got a border that's 5px solid and red, all right? So now that we've done that, we've got this uh, border that goes to here and is uh, five pixels wide, solid instead of uh, dashed lines and red, all right? And so now that we've got that taken care of, we're gonna make the other one, we're gonna say image right here, IMG, and we're gonna say inside of this, uh, width is now 100%. We're gonna say padding is now 5px, and then we're gonna say border is now 5px solid and blue, all right? And you know, it's purple on my screen, but I'm sure it's blue on yours, right? And you can see right here, we've got the padding as well, uh, that's 5px, so we've got five pixels of padding, five pixels of blue, five pixels of red, just like that. So let's check the code. Looks good, and also look here, uh, the uh, blue border is outside of the uh, red border like that too, so we're gonna have to deal with that as well. So it looks good, and submit it. All right, now we're on to step eight, and we'll see you next time.